All right, so remind us, uh, your name, where you're from, what team you're with? Santo Sanchez. Okay. Interview. <laughs> Santo Sanchez, I'm captain of the War Pigs out of Sacramento, California. Okay, and what did the War Pigs do this weekend? So we uh, we competed in the Fives tournament. Uh, we unfortunately did not make it out of our pool, uh, but today we competed in the Twelves and merged with the Twin City Wyverns, fought under the name of the Burninators. And we Burninators? Took, took third place. Um, a lot of good fights today. Um, so we're happy, but we got a lot of work to do still. So it's a great weekend. All right, so how do you feel about how your team did? I uh, think we did very well as far as, you know, we have some, uh, we've merged with uh, a couple of fighters from other California teams, and this is actually the first time we've all actually been able to gel together on an actual tournament for once. So, as an actual did, California United team? Yes, so we did very well, um, but we know that we have a lot of work to be done and a lot of things that need to get done. So. But, What's that? Oh, oh, it's okay. I'll just turn the camera. All right. Um, but, you know, we our attrition is low, but our skill level and everything, we did really well, but I know we can do better, so back to the grind when we get back to California. All right. So. Now, I feel I see you going, ooh, ow, ooh, as you're taking off your armor. Any injury or anything? Uh, so, I have a pre-existing shoulder injury, and towards the last two 12 rounds, uh, I took quite a few shots to the arm. Fortunately, I stayed up, uh, but, you know, that's part of the game, so... <laughs> All right, so what does this whole sport mean to you? This, to me, this is actually a part of my life. Uh, it is a huge stress reliever. It's a way where I can escape and kind of just reset my brain and my body and everything. So it, to me, this is part of my life. This is something I always do until I can't do it anymore. You know? now, I've talked to you at the World Championship in 2015, and I talked to you at the World Championship in 2018. Has your relationship with the sport changed since those years? I'd say it's gotten uh, much more of a deeper relationship over the years. It's become more ingrained into my actual life and actual person of who I am. So, you know, it's much more important than it was all those years ago. And, and uh, do you think that the way you fight has changed? Yes, considerably. I used to just bum rush in blindly like a rabid animal, which is how I got the trash panda name because I'd be like a rabid raccoon. Uh, and then so I've, over the years I've become more collected and calm and kind of calculate my moves instead of just going riding in and getting grappled up and, you know, being a suicide somebody and not being very effective. Now I you know I do a lot more striking, I'm a lot more technical, and you know I can bait people in. My team can pick them up, and you know so a lot more calculated than before. Okay, so. great. Now, what advice would you give to anybody who's thinking about starting out in this game? I would say find your closest team, reach out to them, and get to a practice, and go from there. You know, don't be afraid to just make that call, send that text message, email, just do it and get out there. You know, so that's it. All right, thank you very much. <laughs> Oh. Oh. Ooh, oh, ooh, oh, 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 oh